and let's begin and I already love what I see we do have the reach out and the clarity of belief um, both about communication somebody wants to talk to you um, somebody is clear uh, finally in their head with the ace of swords um, does look like written communication, but in the same time is kind of balanced out by the three of pentacles, reaching out, working together, collaborating, uh, speaking about um, kind of friendship terms, um, commitment terms, right? Three of pentacles is the energy of partnership and somebody is finally clear in their head about something. This can be your energy, we'll see how, how it goes. This can be your energy or the person you are dealing with, but hey, uh, they most certainly observed you. Ace of Swords wanted to come out again. I am going to take this, right? Somebody observed you and they became clear and now they wanna reach out. We do have the Two of Cups, the Temperance and the Strength card. So anyways, I'm just saying, I am done shuffling because the energies simply expose themselves. So, um, yeah, um, they change their perspective uh, for some of you. This is by uh, observing you with the hangman. This is by stretching themselves a little bit, stretching their mind, bringing knowledge to their mind. And the three of pentacles is the energy of, I wanna build with my Aquarius. I believe it's possible to build something that's um, solid with the test of time and um you know has a future so beautiful so let's see aquarius past energies on your side the person you are dealing with and mutual energies let's have current energies on your side the person you are dealing with and mutual energies and let's have the possible outcome for you and the person you are dealing with bottom of the deck oh yeah it was supposed to be yours we do have um the six of cups and we absolutely have your energy the star the healing card um simply love and heal whatever this is this is the love that um will be healed i do believe with the six of cups i now know we all know now right that this is a past relationship can be past life can be um uh, a person you've dealt with um in this lifetime and absolutely will be healed um through the uh, your own energy which is the ace of swords right the energy of the mind the energy of understanding the energy of gaining perspective the energies of enlightenment of the mind you know so aquarius what happened we loved them in the past and we missed them in the past right we lost them that's a five of cups um we do have ace of cups right this is a lot of love love abundance you had way too much love for this person uh, and they probably messed up and we had you in the five of cups missing them somebody might have walked away you might have walked away um with a lot of love again we know how it um how this works when we have the ace of cups in re in um in the in the past we know it's a connection that um of course started with an, a cup of love and probably stopped there um that is a lot of um, new beginnings in it or a, you know a feeling that um you extended um and um i believe you felt sorry about uh that energy of the of the five of cups regrets and guilt maybe it was not the thing to do but you did it that was um this is how you felt and this is how you uh, went by it for some of you but absolutely five of cups after the the ace of cups speaks of maybe you shouldn't have or this is the energy that you were um kind of having um around you now this person of yours absolutely they walked away we do have them in the six of swords energy and in the three of wands um they had expectations life called for them um they needed peace of mind with the six of swords they needed to heal their own wounds in some way and actually they were waiting to heal something by um you know um distancing themselves in some way for some of you you you've dealt with somebody who actually planned and this energy in itself it's like a planning um stage of their life of, of healing something probably away from you and then this partnership went through challenging times we do have the five of wands and the eight of pentacles eight of pentacles the energy of work 
the energy of learning. So maybe you've met this person in school, at work. You've started to work with them on something and then challenging times came. Changes, five of cups, five of wands. It was a hell of a change in the past and somebody needed to walk away. Again, for their own uh, peace of mind. So where are we right now? We absolutely still love this person. Even though the universe is asking you to make choices, we do have the Wheel of Fortune with the Lovers Gemini energy, but this is also the energy of going with the flow, understanding destiny and karma and debts and payments. Um, while it's still combined with this energy of soulmates, we have Six of Cups as the overall energy, definitely soulmates, lovers, still number six, soulmates. And we have Ace of Cups with a Five of Cups, which together it's a Six of Cups, which is the energy of soulmates. So that is no doubt that there is a bond and um, it's like, um, you know, kind of a bond against the odds, right? Of a, um, and challenged one, a very challenged one, kind of like a twin flame journey. But, um, you know, the universe is kind of saying, no, it's a soulmate. Okay, so we go with it. Um, there is a lot of healing, again, energies of, of twin flames, but the universe is saying, you know, sent us the will of fortune just to say, I know, it's a soulmate. Okay, we are bonded for, you know, for the whole um, time. And, um, yeah, so hey, this person of yours, um, they are still going through challenging times. We do have them in the five of wands, struggling, battling something but looking for happiness. We do have them with the sun energy, it can be a Leo you are dealing with. And um, it feels like, um, you know, being aware of the happiness that they need, awakening, awareness, but it's paired with a challenging time. So somebody here is struggling for their own enlightenment, their own happiness, um, wanting to be less conflicted, can speak of internal struggle that they are trying to shine a light on. And um, for some of you dealing with a Leo there, this is kind of a confirmation that, you know what, yeah, eh, life is not good for them. But mutual energies between the two of you, you both want to strengthen bonds um, and you both believe that this connection can work, can have success. It takes, right, the energy of determination, believe and succeed, and it also takes uh, it takes also the energy of the strengthening bonds, which is my investment card, right? Let's take it from scratch. Let's build on it step by step. It's the energy of break by break um, energy with the Ace of Pentacles and also the energy of, um, you know, um, I believe it is possible and I every day I will put something into this connection till it becomes a success, you know, that is um, also it comes with a conviction for both of you that maybe it was a missed opportunity, but it's it's the energy of, well, it never took off. So maybe, you know, um, it's like starting new again, you know, that's energy of Ace of Pentacles, um, kind of the energy of getting to know each other. Um, but then that is love and then that is a desire to be happy so it's a change in perspective here well moving forward I do love the wish fulfillment and the seven of wands kind of the universe is saying keep going um, um, you know it is um, dreams are not away from you right now on the contrary right dreams and wish fulfillment is coming your way but still, you'll have to be strategic and choose your battles. You'll have to stay strong. You'll have to fight the good fight. And you'll have to say no when it's the time to say no. Oh my God, look how you mirror each other. Because they want to offer you commitment and wish fulfillment. Um, Aquarius, commitment and wish fulfillment, Taurus energy. If you are dealing with a Taurus, absolutely. Somebody here is actually committed to uh, make you happy, to make you shine to bring happiness in this connection. They wanna come back, that's for sure. And this is the energy of without you, they went through challenging times and they understood where their happiness is, right? Because they have now the energy of the, of the shine in their hands. So they know what shines, they know what is real, they know what the truth is, but it comes with challenges and changes because that's life and they have a couple of lessons to learn Oh my God, energy is becoming your way. 
between the two of you we do have the ace of pentacles and the two of cups well that is loving this one like crazy this is again the soulmate bond the spiritual union with the two of cups and the ace of pentacles is the energy of starting new starting from scratch getting to know each other investing in this every day a little bit um putting a foundation to this one and um, the the energy of abundance you know this has the potential to grow and it's such a healing love it is such a healing love and you show up here so we know this is um, your reading and we know this is your love um Aquarius. in terms of energies they might be um we have the hangman pisces cancer we do have aquarius like yourself we do have Gemini, we have Leo energy, and we have Taurus energy, just in case you want to know. So Aquarius, let's ask for some guidance. Let's see if we take them back or if we encourage them someplace else. So Aquarius, we do have, imagine that you have to focus on yourself, right? The guidance is love who you are. You are divine, delightful, and deserving of the wonderful things life has to offer. So I don't know if we are going through some self-esteem struggle, um, you know, but love who you are actually, it is a reminder to somebody out there that actually, you know, you are divine, you are delightful and deserving. So focus on yourself, I would say. We do have consider your foundation. This is really, uh, you know, life is bringing happiness and love and wish fulfillment, but it comes with some homework. And I kind of feel in the guidance that this is your homework, right? Consider your foundation. Look at how committed you are to love. So love who you are and consider your foundation. This is quite a deep work on yourself that you are guided to do, um, Aquarius. We also have love makes the difference. Love helps heal past hurts and provides a sense of security and self-worth. Uh, we're discussing self-esteem and self-worth. So it's kind of a 360, right? In terms, of, in terms of advice. Love makes the difference. Love helps heal past hurts and provides a sense of security and self-worth. Um... Let's see the guardian angels, what are we guided to do? It's such a deep work that you are guided to do on yourself. It's kind of one of the, um, probably this commitment is one of those commitments where, um, you know, that, that requires a lot of work on yourself so, so that you can um, ascend together with this person so that you can um, help this person or heal the connection that is, that is something that is required from you here, Aquarius, and it's not, it's no small thing, right? Um, I mean, consider your foundation, and I do want to get, I want to keep my readings a little bit, um, you know, kind of on the, on the light, um, I want to plant seeds, right? But consider your foundation, this is, um, this is actually a very important, um, you know, a piece of work that you need to do in your life, so... And it goes deep so um hey we do have the chariot be open to success that is success coming your way um and i hope you are uh, going to see it we have you going with the flow which is good um will of fortune is um, the energy of you being in the uh, flow with the universe so not blocking at this time anything and because of it we have success so we do have be open to success so Aquarius, look at all the wonderful things you can do when you listen to your divine guidance. You've balanced so many different priorities and have come out a winner. There will be a lot of recognition and praise headed your way, but don't be shy. Allow others to shower you with the gratitude you deserve. Bottom of the deck, seven of pentacles. That is success, but that is also the right time for it. We do have seven of abundance. Have patience. Sometimes dream grow slowly. Don't worry. The hard work you've invested will bring about a bountiful harvest. This is a good time to prepare because things will soon move um, forward quickly. Use this time to rest and plan. Yeah. Now let's see the universe we need to the um, 
sorry the let's see the energies we need to bring back into the flow we do have gratitude aquarius we forgot to be grateful oh come on we can do this i am thankful for this life and the opportunities it presents i'm thankful for this life and the opportunity opportunities it presents we do have compassion right aquarius we need to be grateful and compassionate towards the other person you demonstrate the language of the heart by actively sharing and living love we have failure what's going on i understand that a mistake is only an opportunity to learn right the mentality of actually it's not a failure it's not a step back it's an opportunity to to learn something surrender i can release my need to control and bottom of the deck surrender obsessive thinking if you're obsessing about a person or situation turn the dilemma over to this to spirit doing so will help bring you clarity and even solve a problem hey i get this energy um aquarius of working on yourself you have three actually the love cards are all about your foundation your work the way you relate to love we have the energy of patience which is in itself the energy of working on yourself and then you have all this surrendering uh, and surrendering obsessive thinking and uh, being compassionate and grateful for the, the phase you are in so i would say a lot of um a lot of introspection i would say you are guided to have at this time and that is a lot of love heading your way by the way are you kidding me two of cups and nine of cups twice you mirror each other that is a world of love in this um so hey aquarius you know i love you right i wish you nothing but the best i wanted to stay strong and safe and come see me next time love you take care